pole position, a great start by Josh Brooks, an awful one for Graham Gowland, gets sucked back into the pack from his first front row start, but it's Michael Laverty who dives first into Riches at the beginning of that race. And uh, he then gets embroiled in a three-way battle with uh, Josh Brooks and Tommy Hill. John Kirkham saw him looking on his return, and that causes real problems for number 34, Alistair Seeley. He also gets forced off track as Brooks attacks the race leader, Michael Laverty. And the two swan Yamahas of Tommy Hill and Nitro Norihaga are also in contention. Fanning out down the Bentley straight then into the S's. Tommy Hill makes a terrific late charge through. Can't quite hold the line. Josh Brooks squeezes past. And Laverty says, thank you very much, and grabs the space that's drawn open and retakes the lead. Michael Laverty then at the front for Samsung Honda. Hill back to third place. But Tommy is not to be outfoxed. He then outbreaks Josh Brooks, number two, into Agostini's. And then he's taking a look at number seven, Michael Laverty. Gets alongside him down the Bentley straight, down to Brundle's left-hander underneath the bridge. And this time, Tommy defends his line, holds onto the lead. The Swan Yamaha now has the advantage. Brooks back into second place, had a huge moment when he loses the back end into the Montreal hairpin. Just avoids contact with Tommy Hill, which could have been a disaster for both of them. And then Josh retakes that second place from Michael Laverty. And uh, the two blue and white bikes locked together, but Michael Laverty takes a long, calm look over his shoulder, realises there's no danger from behind, makes another move on Brooks and starts to, starts to open up a gap. But uh, there's nothing he can do about the reigning champion. Tommy Hill, number one, through the final turn at Murray's and up the hill to record, uh, well, the only man to win two races in BSP this year. Swan Yamaha, Tommy Hill, victorious at Snetterton.